future is, but uh, it was great to, to be here and witness him. And share this field with him on what very well could be his last game. This was a weird first quarter. Yeah. Nobody scored. You guys finally find the end zone on, a, on an underhand pass to Jarek McKinnon. What changed for you guys? I think we just we came back with the energy. In the first quarter, we were playing tentative. Uh, started with me, um, and uh, I think that when we got in that second quarter, we kind of got back to who we are, and uh, hopefully we keep this momentum going to next week. Who you are also is a lot of fun plays. The touchdown throw to Allegretti, and then you had Travis Kelsey throwing a touchdown pass. How much of that was a product of where you were at that point in the game? How much of it was just, this is where we're going? Yeah, the, the one to Allegretti, he's like the fifth option on that play, and they, they, they covered everybody else, and uh, he just popped open, so I threw it to him. Um, but uh, the, the Travis one, uh, we worked all week. Um, it's like going off the, the plays that when he's running down the middle, and he played a little quarterback at Cincinnati, so we give him a chance here and there. Yeah, he did. You're, you're moving on. And Travis had told me this week, it's Super Bowl or bust, and we got to win this thing. There's no... Nothing less is acceptable. How do you guys feel about that? Yeah, we keep that mindset. I mean, when you've been to the Super Bowl in the last two years, um, and you walk off that field with a loss last year, you want you want to go back and get that revenge and get that win. And so for us, um, we understand it's a hard division. They have seen that the Bills coming here this next week, um, and we're about to play our best football. And so uh, we're, we're just excited for the journey. Uh, we'll stay with the process, and I'm glad we're playing at Arrowhead uh, next week. We'll be watching. Congratulations, Patrick. Yeah, thank you.